You know, the whole time I've been laying here just thinking about younger, like being younger when I used to cut my wrists and everything, and it was kind of a trend thing. Like, people, when they were depressed, they would cut their wrists, yada, yada phases or whatever some people are generally depressed you know i don't deal with depression as badly as i used to but the thing is though in a way you think about it you cut yourself why you're genuinely depressed again opposite of what the bible speaks about basically you cut yourself while you're trying to get these releases, dopamine levels, but you're trying to, you're trying to grab a hold of that sense of humanity, like knowing that you're alive, that release to know that you're alive, that you could feel still. With whole with the Holy Spirit, it's like a tunnel. How I see it, it's like a tunnel, basically. It's a tunnel from my spiritual man all the way up to heaven, and I'm communicating back and forth to God. And basically, the Holy Spirit keeps me because without the Holy Spirit in my life, I can't. I feel like I believe honestly, I could not keep in touch with my humanity. That's why I need the Holy Spirit. I have to stay in touch with Him. This world, man, is just dead to me. And basically, it's like I've been, I was just sitting here thinking of that. Why? Why did we used to do it? Why did I used to do it when I was younger and cut myself? It was basically, it was like more than just thinking deep, more deeply about it. It's not just about for me being depressed it's about me stay, trying to stay in touch with my humanity and basically that's what it was but I don't need to do that anymore since I have the Holy Spirit he keeps me in touch and I don't, there's no need for me to be depressed anymore because he keeps me alive assured resting assured and at peace at peace no matter what some days feel harder than the rest. Some days feel hard, but he still keeps me at, at ease in my mind, heart, soul, mind, and spirit. So, so on. God bless.